going on? How are you? I'm excited are you? to talk to you. Are you all bleary eyed? Yes. Yeah, more actors to talk to. Yay! We always love talking oh, to you. Oh. There's that. So this coming season, he's just all about killing as many as he can. Is there something deeper going on? Not all about killing. Okay. Uh, there's other stuff going on that's uh, that's. Uh, this season definitely starts to peel the onion a little bit, and you start to see a lot of different levels to him. But there is a lot of killing. Yeah. <laughs> he 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 he, uh, he enjoys where he's at in this uh, apocalyptic setting. You know, he's, he's flourishing. He's getting stronger. He's getting smarter. His knowledge is is going through the roof. Um, uh, I'm learning a lot from Satrakian. Uh He's a quick learner. Um, He's becoming a, 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 a revolutionary, you know, kind of uh, vampire killer. He's, 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 he believes he's, he's the best at it. I think he is. Will he have new allies this year to help him with this? Yeah, yeah. Some really interesting allies come along uh, uh, down the line. Um, uh, you know, people connect that you might not uh, have expected. And, and uh, the... the, the the true group of allies within Fett's abode, uh, they're all in his space, and he's like a lone wolf. He's a little uncomfortable about it because he's uh, he's pretty meticulous by nature, you know, a little uh, obsessive uh, about where things should go and, and about how people should behave within his place. And um, But he uh, puts up with it because he's actually going to like these people. Some of them a lot more than others, um, and uh, and he's pragmatic. He knows that they're all better off. They'll last longer if they're together. Every, everyone's uh, everyone has a uh, precious kind of skills, knowledge that uh, all together they're 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 strong. So Turkey seems a little uh, out of sorts a little bit at the beginning of the season and um, maybe a little lack of confidence or whatever, like he's had some, some blows happen. Does your character help him through that? Uh, it seems like, you know, because there's this good relationship with them. That... Yeah. I mean, Fett really wants to help as much as he can, I mean, but the old fella is so set in his ways that um, I think ultimately he does help him. Um, but uh, he's a stubborn, stubborn old fellow. Um, they've, uh, yeah, they've definitely become a lot closer to, uh, uh, become a lot closer. They're kind of uh, developing kind of like a father-son kind of connection. And uh, as we know, father, uh, Bet had kind of a strained relationship with his father. And, was constantly disappointing him because he didn't become what he wanted him to be. And his father never um, respected his wishes either, so he's kind of stepping out in the world and kind of giving it the finger and going, I'm going to be something. And that's why he's so filled with all of this information because he wanted to be the greatest rat exterminator in the five boroughs, maybe in the world. And uh, now he has an opportunity to, to save the world. How about that, Dad? Take that, you know. Um, so it's uh, it's pretty cool. It's really fun to play. What can you tell us about Fett and Dutch? Um, I think it's the first time that that Fett looks into a woman's eyes and kind of sees his reflection. Someone who's strong, rebellious, and uh, smart, full of piss and vinegar, passion, you know? and so it, it both kind of excites him, kind of scares him a little bit, kind of all the good stuff, you know, so it's kind of interesting to see where it goes. And uh, Ruta's, Ruta Goodman, this is an incredible actress, She's so, such a good actress to work with, and, uh, yeah, I think it's been really good. Uh, yeah, I think you'll enjoy the trip. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Already? <laughs>